What is going on guys? Skylar Bush here, here, Skytality, whatever you want to call me. Uh, back here with another video. Um, I know it's kind of a shocker, but um, kind of wanted to just make a normal video, test out this type of video that is. Um, obviously the gameplay, a little less important here, just some CSGO from the other day, playing some gun game. Um, yeah, so... Pretty much, I just wanted to talk about, like, the current state of gaming and kind of just how that's been recently. I feel like gaming is in a very weird but good spot. So, obviously, recently, um, a few big games that we've been waiting for have dropped. Uh, Mortal Kombat 1 was either today or yesterday, I don't remember. Starfield was last week, uh, Baldur's Gate 3, um, Diablo 4, some of the big names this year, uh, Legend of Zelda, probably going to win Game of the Year, honestly. Um, I personally just went through one of the quarantine, games of all of quarantine, um, I just beat Elden Ring myself, um, really enjoyed that game, um, uh, really enjoyed going through my first time my first playthrough and uh yeah yeah so how i wanted to do this video was talk about the recent games that have come out and just kind of how i feel about them generally um yeah so starting off the bat uh mortal kombat 1 just came out i personally uh am excited for it don't know if I'll cough up the money, the 70 bucks to get it, but um, I personally have enjoyed seeing the the kind of niche character picks that they did for this roster. Um, I've been a, a Mortal Kombat fan for most of my life. I grew up playing um, not necessarily the classics, not Ultimate Mortal Kombat 3 or anything like that. I played the PlayStation 2 games because that's what I grew up with. The Armageddons, the Deceptions, um, Shaolin Monks, those types of th uh, Mortal Kombat games. And then as I grew older and older, I played Mortal Kombat 9, Mortal Kombat X, Mortal Kombat 11. I was a big Injustice 1 fan. Not so much of the Injustice 2, but yeah, I'm real excited to see what happens with Mortal Kombat 1. Um, Starfield also just came out. Um, I'm personally, I don't know if I'd say I'm a Bethesda fan. I don't mind Bethesda games, but they're not necessarily my bread and butter, I guess. Um, growing up, I had a, a best friend when I was in early element, or early middle school, late elementary school. Uh, he was a big Fallout 3 fan, and so I kind of got into Fallout 3 then. So I have some, like, core memories of playing some Bethesda games. I remember getting Skyrim, but unpopular opinion, I did not play Skyrim all too much. I have it on PC, I just haven't really given it too much of a chance. Um, so I feel like Starfield is is definitely going to be up there. I've heard it's a pretty one-to-one -one as a space Skyrim. A uh, few complaints here and there about the story, but... You know, everybody's a critic kind of thing, and I'm not going to, you know, dog on something that I personally haven't played. Um, yeah. No, and then a, another game that I'm excited for it to come out, but I have not, obviously. It's not out yet. Um, X Defiant. I've played it a little bit, obviously, during the beta. If you were around my Twitch streams when the beta was out, I played it with a couple of my friends, my co-workers. They're more friends than co-workers. Um, but, yeah. No, I'm really excited to see X Defiant grow. Um, I I personally played Call of Duty a bunch as a kid. I played Black Ops 1. I played Black Ops 2. Mar for 2. Mar for 3. Uh, Ghosts. And then, from then on, I kind of kept a close eye on the series. I didn't necessarily play... I didn't play Vanguard at all. I didn't play Infinite Warfare at all. Um, I played a little bit Marvel Remastered. Um, but I did buy Cold War. I played a little bit of Cold War. I played Marvel Warfare 2019 quite a bit. Um, have not really played Marvel Warfare 2 at all. Except for I played Warzone 2. Just a 
tad bit. Um, other than that, yeah, I, uh, I'm excited to see x Fight because it had that kind of old Call of Duty feel to it. A um, little bit of, like, the the newer Black Ops feel as well with, like, the operators because you had your special agents and their abilities. Again, you you know, I, I played, uh, played the healers. Um, I can't think of their name. Libertad, that's their name. Uh, again, if you were around the streams, um, definitely keep an eye on it for when XOAC comes out. I will be streaming that a lot more. Obviously, if you are around my uh, Twitch channel, which link in bio, obviously, I always do that. Um, I still play a lot of Valorant whenever I can. Uh, kind of burnt out on it a little bit, but yeah. Let me know if you guys do enjoy this type of video. I will definitely make more. If you hit that like button, comment down below, and hit that subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.